Scattering stuff in Blender can be a performance nightmare if you are not careful. You can throw in some grass, rocks or debris and before you know it, your viewport starts lagging as if you are running your project on a potato computer. The problem isn't just the number of polygons, but the sheer number of separate objects Blender has to process. That's why we're going to talk about dual level scatter, which works around this by grouping instances into large mesh blocks before scattering them, which drastically cuts down the number of processes your machine has to calculate. So instead of handling thousands of tiny individual objects, Blender processes fewer, larger ones, and the result, a performance boost while keeping the scene dense and detailed. It also comes with camera calling, so Blender only bothers rendering what's actually in view which means in simple terms, no more wasting resources on stuff that you will never see. On top of that, there is a procedural wind animation that gives scattered objects a bit of movement. And if you're working on dense outdoor environments, these setups make things easier while keeping everything running smoothly. 